Hi, my dear fitness friends. Today I have for you a 30 minute body weight hit and Tabata workout to do. Only piece of equipment that I'm gonna be using in this workout is my plyo box. And we are starting it off with a no rest Tabata pair that is core focused. If you need more than that to get ready to do box jumps and I fall in the next upcoming hit set, please push pause and get your body all warmed up and ready to go and then join me on the mat for that Tabata pair in just a minute. All right, guys, I'm ready to hit start on this Tabata pair. We are beginning with cross crunches. So you'll do a right side cross crunch. You're pairing that with the left side cross crunch. Those are the 20 second intervals. In the 10 second rest period, we're gonna be doing an elbow, side plank hold on your elbow, okay? So I'm gonna hit start right away. You've got a 10 second countdown. Let's get it started. On your back, on the mat. Three, two. Right arm going first, left leg. Cross crunch it up. Nice and smooth. Keep that right foot off the ground throughout the entire 20 second interval. At the beep, I'm going into an elbow plank on my right arm. Actually, on my left arm. <laughs> so the arm that I was not just using. So just hold that elbow T-stand plank right here. At the beep, you're gonna be cross crunching with your left arm. So come on down, get it going. Start to breathe, set some intentions into this move. You're using your core to pull that leg up. At the beep, you're going into an elbow, T-stand on the right side this time. So come on up, make sure those hips are pointed forward, hold it tight. You're gonna go back into a right side cross crunch right now. So right arm is going. This is going to be a fast and furious 30 minute workout. <laughs> it will fly by. Get ready to do a left arm elbow T stand. Get on it. Try to make your transition smooth. Going back into a left arm cross crunch at the beep. Come on down, crunch it up. Sometimes, all you have is yourself and 30 minutes to do a great workout. You can get a lot done in 30 minutes. So you're committing yourself to this time and these efforts. So make it count. Right arm T-stand. Make sure you're breathing. Starting to feel nice and warm. Right arm cross crunch to your left foot. Keep that leg up off the ground. Don't let it touch down. Almost there. Getting into your elbow T-stand again. And one, come on up. This time lift your leg because you can hold it. Three, two, one. Left arm cross crunch. Your core is starting to get fired up. Bring it to a right side, elbow T stand, and a leg lift. Hold it. Breathe it out. This is your final round of the right side cross crunch. Don't let that foot go down. I was just putting my foot down. Stay focused. Left side, T-stand, and the leg lift right now. Lift it up. Three, two, one. Final 20 second interval right here. Keep that right leg up off the ground. seconds. Keep it going. And two stand, leg lift to finish it off. Where is it? Oh my gosh. Was that like the longest 10 seconds <laughs> ever? <laughs> oh my goodness. 
All right, we're gonna move straight into our hit set. We're doing a burpee and a lateral box jump to start. So I'm gonna go up and over my box. If you don't like lateral box jumps, you just do a forward back box jump, okay? Just do you. A lot of people don't like lateral box jumps. I get it. Pairing next move is a commando plank, tricep push up, dive bombers with spider knees, hitch kick, single leg burpees, ninja jump, double butt kicker. 50 second intervals. We're going through it two times. That makes it a 10 minute set. Let's go. Hitting start. You got 10 seconds. So first is a burpee lateral box jump. I'm just gonna pull it right out. You guys are at 24 inches right now. So hop back, push up, hop it up, lateral box jump. Step it down. Other side. Step it down. Again, make changes to your workout. I always say this. You have to make sure that you take the authority to make changes to make a workout suit you. We're here to have challenges. We're here to sweat and get stronger by pushing ourselves to do hard things. But if something doesn't suit you, don't risk an injury to do it. That's one. Next move is a command up plank and a tricep push up. Completely warmed up now. So, high plank position, command up down first, back up. Now, tricep push up. Command down, up, tricep push up. Get that chest all the way to the mat. You deserve a full push up. Hold your body tight when you're doing those commandos. Stay here, I know it's hard. Three, two, one. Nice job. Third move, I've got a dive bomber and spider knees. I know. I did these push up moves back together on purpose. You can do it. Dive bomb under, dive bomb back up, get two spider knees. Nice job, dive bomber. What if you just said to yourself, oh yeah. I can do two minutes of plank push-up moves, no problem. I got this. What if you encouraged yourself instead of doubting yourself? If you need some help with that, let me help you. You got this. You can do this. You're in the right place. You belong here. We've got a hitch kick and a single leg burpee. So starting with that hitch kick. This is a really tough balance move. Don't beat yourself up over it. If you need to put your foot down and balance yourself before you get the next hitch kick, just do it. improves just like your strength does when you work at it. Yeah. All right, we are on to our fifth move, which is a ninja and two double butt kickers. So, ninja up, double butt kick one, two, back to your ninja. You 
You got this. Do your quads burn. Get mine do too. Last one. All right, we've got the ninja double butt kickers to finish off this 10 minute hit set. That's right, you just did that. You did a no rest of ala. you just did 10 minutes of hit. Body weight, strength, focused hit. 
a little cardio like the boss you are. I am talking to you. I'm not just talking to myself. Fifteen seconds. Stay here. My legs are burning too. I'm also breathless. You made it. Okay, we're going into our next Tabata pair. We have squat jumps, plain old squat jumps. At the beat, you do a squat hold. Next 20 second move is three switch lunges to a pistol squat. In that last period, you're also doing a squat hold. Don't doubt yourself, don't think too much about it. I will coach you through every step of the way. 10 second countdown is on. Let's go, squat jump. That's it, just squat jumps, you got this. 20 seconds of jumping. Hold at the beep. One. Hold it. We're going to three switch lunges and a pistol. If you cannot do a pistol, you make a modification. You either keep doing switch lunges or you simply do a squat. Bring that back leg up. Get a pistol. All the way down. All the way up. Nice and steady. You don't need to fly through these. Squat hold. Put those elbows inside those knees. Put a smile on your face. You're like, no way, Julia, I don't need when this interval's over. <laughs> 10 seconds. Get ready for a squat hold. Three, two, one. We're going into our three switch lunges and pistols at the beep in four seconds. Three, two, one, stand up, switch lunge. One, two, three, get your pistol. A lot of balance, a lot of strength. One, two, three, my quads are on fire just like yours. Trust me, squat hold. Squat jumps again, and you will be more than halfway done with this set. I underestimated the burn of those squat holds. <laughs> but what if you just say to yourself, yeah, it burns, but I can still hold it. Yeah, it burns, but I'm not failing. And if I do fail, it's just my limit. That's it. And next time I do it, maybe my limit will get better because I'm getting stronger. Switch on this. Oh my gosh. Pistol. Shaky breath from a body weight strength set here is always a good thing. Squat hold. Flat jumps, final round. Yes, you made it. You can do these hard things. <laughs> Take this lesson that you just learned about yourself and apply it everywhere else in your life. Three, two, squat hold. Getting out of the squat hold into the switch lunges is the hardest. Oh my goodness. Three, two, one. Let's go. Gain your focus, gain your inner calm, 
and this chaos, squat hold. 10 seconds and you're out of this interval. Four, three, two, one. <laughs> Look at that. You didn't think you could do it. Okay. We have 180 vertical frog jumps. So, touching down like a frog, jumping up and spinning, okay? That's our first 20 second interval. In the beat, you're gonna go into a crow pose. Crow pose is that yogi pose, yoga pose, where you're putting your knees up underneath the back of your armpits and doing your very best to balance and hold your face up off the mat. If that is not something that you can do, just hold the crow pose with your feet on the ground, okay? Gain some confidence in yourself, maybe get to your toes, maybe pick one toe up. Do what you wanna do. Pairing that with plank jack push-ups and you do get a rest after those, okay? I told you that you can do hard things and I'm gonna prove it to you right now. You can do a lot in 30 minutes. Here we go, vertical frog jumps. Touch it down, jump it around. Now we're gonna go back the other direction. This goes really fast. Plank jack push-ups. Jack those legs out. Get a push-up. At the beep, you get 10 seconds rest. Nice job. These wrists are nice, huh? <laughs> 180 frog jumps coming at you. Here we go. I'm gonna go full circle again. That was fun. How are you doing? Check in with yourself. Are you applauding your victories here? Are you making changes that you need to make to feel good, to feel strong? At the beat, plank jack push-ups. Let's go. Keep that face looking up, chest down to the mat. At the beat, you get 10 seconds. Nice job. Vertical frog jump again. And then you're more than halfway down with this interval. This Tabata set. Crow pose at the beat. Here we go. Get on it. Support yourself. Plank jack push-ups. Elbows go. Back. Not out wide. 45 degree angle. Shooting out from your body. Two, one, 10 seconds rest. You guys are doing awesome. I'm so proud of you. Final round here. 180s. Doubt is 
greatness. You can do a lot of great things in 30 minutes. We're proving that to ourselves right now. Okay, guess what? We have one more Tabata pair. We're doing a broad jump, bunny hop back, and a burpee heel grab. I'm putting a no rest in here. We're gonna do plank hold for the 10 seconds. 10 second countdown wrong. Cause you can, that's why. Broad jump, bunny hop back. Here we go. Broad jump, little bunnies all the way back. Broad jump.
Just do it as fast as you can for as long as you can. No rest. Five minutes, you got this. Here we go. I'm gonna have it beep every minute on the minute just so we know where we're at. I will be counting out my reps. You can stick with me or do it on your own. Or just allow me to do the count for you. Leg drops on your back. Legs are up. Let's hold that crunch up here too. Drop for five. One. Two. Three. Four. And five. Bring them down. In and out. So start to appear at the top. Out wide. For one. Two. Three. Four. Five. On your back, bicycles, coming on one leg only. One, two, three, four, and five. Stand on up, you gotta roll back, and jump at the top for five. One, 
two, less than 30 seconds. Three, four, five, bicycles. One, two, three, four, five, roll it back to the beep. <laughs> that was amazing. 30 minutes, no equipment, hard workout. That was advanced. I'm so proud of you. I love you all so much. I will see you at the next workout.